Welcome to Pasta Grannies in Sardinia. Anna Manai is showing us how to make maloreddos. Allora, mi chiamo Anna e prepariamo i maloreddos. A posto. Un po' d'acqua calda. She uses local semola flour and warm water to make a stiff dough and then kneads it for a good 20 minutes. Questa è la prima lavorazione. Okay. Ecco. Anna says it's important the dough is left to relax for at least 30 minutes, so she made another batch earlier. Then she rolls out a rope of pasta and breaks off hazelnut-sized pieces. Anna uses a special basket with a reed base to roll the pieces of pasta. This creates the ridged, curved shape of malaredus. Her friend Paola prefers a modern wood board to make her malaredus. In Gilaza, malaredus are small and don't include the saffron in the dough. But they both agree the malaredus should be dried on the huge linen-covered basket trays. It was such fun, I had to have a go. Ecco, aiuto, ecco, bravo. Bravo. My first in Alaredas. Aiuta, ah, a posto. Mine are bigger than yours, though. That's not a good thing. Ecco, a posto. These are fun. That's fantastic. Grazie mille. I want to do one more. For the sugo, Anna fries diced pork and then stirs in roughly chopped onion, parsley and thyme. The sun-dried tomatoes are a typically Sardinian addition. Anna adds fresh bay and basil. She says you should always add whole basil leaves as cutting spoils the flavour. She likes a mixture of passata and chopped tomatoes as the malaridus holds the sauce better. Qualche pezzettino di pomodoro che si trova in mezzo a Sor Maloredos. Okay. To assemble the dish, Anna boils the pasta in salted water. They take around five minutes to cook, but she tests for doneness. Sì? She ladles over the sugo and finishes with grated pecorino and more fresh basil. Il piatto è pronto. Malaredos con sugo di maiale. It's delicious. Click on the subscribe button for regular helpings of Pasta Grannies.